Howdy y'all, welcome to Lex Lives. Ah, I think it's time we play a little Seven Days to Die. Well, I have just finished watching uh, Sunday's episode of... Last Sunday's episode, this Sunday's episode of uh, The Walking Dead. Uh, so we are moving into... Uh, what do they call it? Alexandria? Which is where I've been thinking they were headed to all season. And, uh... So, uh... Yeah, we're just about to... Just about to catch up where I left off reading the comic. Which is pretty cool. Um, I'm not sure how they'll play out this story uh, since some of the some of the characters in the oh, I can hear you where are you some of the characters involved in this story are no longer alive on the show of course things are way different of course between the comic and the show um uh trying to remember how it all played out. Um, I want to say... I want to say Carl... Carl was shot in the eye. <laughs> and so he has a eye patch he wears. And Rick lost his arm going into this. Um, which, of course, is is different than uh, different than the show. But uh, some of the rest of it here is pretty pretty close. Oh, you know, I should check to see. That is a shotgun barrel. I have a shotgun barrel. Shotgun barrel. Um, what happened in Sunday's episode is pretty close to what I remember being in the comic book. Uh, they, uh, you know, they've sent out uh, gatherers, scouts, whatever, who uh, try to figure out what people might be oh, nice, might be useful to. Uh, the town and bring them back after they've decided whether or not they're safe. Well, safe-ish. I mean, at this point, if you're still alive, you're probably not safe. Although that priest was holed up in his church for a long time, so... Um, uh, I don't have a pistol. Weird. I had a pistol. I am gonna get rid of this torch. Do I have a bandana on? Yeah. I do not need a new bandana then. Whoops. Uh, but it's uh, I don't know. It's uh, it was a pretty good episode. I. I don't know if I liked it better than the previous episode, um, but it's more <laughs> the whole the whole series basically is just the struggle to maintain their humanity in the light of the zombie apocalypse. Oh, look at that pistol! It's much nicer than the one I just picked up. Those are some ugly boots. I don't know what that is. Not wearing those. I besides I already got my own boots. Um, I'm wearing iron boots. The 
<laughs> most of this episode was, uh... Okay, so last episode... So, uh, alright, I'm all over the place here. My, uh, my DVR does not record shows because of the way they air shows now. Uh, it's really irritating. Um, I don't know who thought... Well, I understand why they do it. <laughs> but not every show does it, so... When I record things, I might record two shows in a row. And so you always miss, like, the last 10, 15 seconds of your show every time because they want you to be watching their show. Hunting rifle, pistol slide, pistol receiver. That's all the parts right there for a pistol. Um... Okay, so what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna. Um. Oh, you know what? I didn't. I didn't make a bed either to lock my. My. <laughs> you know what? This uh, this little tab thing up here at the top confuses me every time. It's it's the color of the word, but this looks like it's a tab, and it looks like it's activated. And so I'm always clicking the wrong thing because of that. Here, make me a better roll real quick. That's leather. I did that before. Come on make a bad roll. But, um... Oh, I forgot what I was talking about. Oh, and so I missed, uh, I missed last episode. At the end of it, they, uh, they introduced whatever his name is, the new scout guy that knows about Alexandria and wants to recruit them to come be in Alexandria. And, uh, so, he, uh, He talks with them a little bit. With Maggie and... Sasha. Um, that was really stretching it right there, by the way. Okay, I don't actually want to use these to make this. I want to do... I want to do this. I might not be able to do it though because I don't know if I have the pistol book. How do I make? I don't have the pistol book. I can't make them. Dang it! That's just like an awesome opportunity there with uh, all the pistol parts just being all right there. Okay. Well, I can't do that. So. Uh, what do I want to get rid of and what do I want to keep? Um, Alright, let's, let's get rid of the shotgun barrel for now. And the strips. And the 7.62. And the 10 millimeters, because I don't really use those. I'll keep my sharp stones and my wood. And... I guess I could keep all the parts of the pistol then for when I can do it. If I don't find something I want more, of course. I dare you. I'm over here. Um, but so... Andrew, I think, was his name? That's in my brain. Try to scrounge up names. I am terrible with names. Um, so, Andrew... Andrew was the scout, and then he's traveling with... Uh, I don't remember the other guy's name. 
Um, Eric. Yeah. Uh, and uh, so Eric stay behind and uh, Eric and Andrew. Oh, I thought that stone was crawling toward me. Okay, what did I just loot? I just went through this house, right? And that. Alright. So let me come over this one. Uh, but, uh, you know, it's it's playing out pretty much pretty much the way I'm expecting. That looks like a horrible door to get through. What's your back door look like? <laughs> oh, it's open. Oh, I already looted this place, right? Because we came down in here and checked the... Check the area down here last episode. Um, and, uh, so you know, Rick doesn't trust them, of course. Uh, because Rick is. Rick is becoming extremely violently agitated by everything. And, uh, he's just. He's reaching his overwhelmed breaking point once again. Oh, those are 10 millimeter. Shotgun shells. It's blast shots. I can't take. I really should take those shotgun shells. I feel. Who am I kidding? I didn't ever use a gun. What I need is some recipe books. Use some armor schematics. You know the good stuff. Um. But uh. Yes, yeah, so they they made it to Alexandria uh, in this episode. Uh, they were when my TV cut off. They were outside the gates. Um, it'll be interesting to see how this plays out as opposed to the way the comic played out. Uh, the the big difference, really, other than you know like Carl and Rick looking different than they do. Um, was, uh, Andrea was still alive in the comic. And Andrea's been dead for... since last season? Come on, let me loot this thing. And, uh, she... She died on the show, I looked it up, because I couldn't remember, to, uh, self-inflicted gunshot wound after she had been bitten. Thanks to the governor. Uh, in fact, I think he plays a big role in... No, no, I think he might be a different guy. I can't remember. Uh, it's been a while since I, like I said, read the comics. I read them before Season 4. Uh, what do we got here? We've got... Home Maintenance, and we got... Bookshot Weekly. Alright. Really? Alright, there we go. Now I can make shotgun shells. I wonder if I have that maintenance thing. I don't know. I did not. Now I can make the... What'd you do with my water? No. That bookshelf ate my water. Dang you, bookshelf. I can't believe the bookshelf ate my water. Or drank, I guess. The bookshelf drank my water. I was going to use that. Um, but, uh, yeah, Andrea plays a huge role in the... <laughs> in the comic at this point, And she's not even on the show anymore. So, I don't know... I mean, they're just going to change the storyline a little bit. Or a lot. I don't know. But, uh... Yeah, I... <laughs> in the in the comic... Um, you heard the... Uh, well, okay. If you watch the episode, you may have heard... Eric... Or not Eric. Uh, Andrew... Mention scavengers... I think he called them. And... Um, in the comic, there's a... I know I've mentioned this before when talking about The Walking Dead. Uh, Alright, I already got the Forge book. 
but there's like a, a refinery nearby this place. I'm pretty sure it's a refinery. It's a factory anyways. It's as far as I read the book, it's when they, they got to the factory. And, um... You guys are slow. Oh, I think we got zombie respawns. At least my game isn't all glitchy today like last time. I don't know what was up with it last time. I wasn't rendering or anything. I wasn't downloading. I wasn't... I have no idea. I've done nothing different. I haven't even rebooted my computer since that day. Uh, I guess the only thing I'm not doing is uploading, but I've never had uploading cause it. Oh, crap. I even heard that guy come up to me, and then I didn't do anything about it. Holy zombie infestation. Uh, but, uh, yeah, when they get to Alexandria, the place is... Um, basically walled itself off before the zombie hordes even reached them, and they've got, like, solar power and stuff. So, they're still living kind of the way they did before. Oh, what's this? Home maintenance. I already did that one. And, uh... So they've never even been... That's... I don't, I don't know that I've... I want to say I don't think I've ever seen wooden chests just laying out like that before. But I'm probably wrong. Alright, I can't even hit you. What? Dang it. <laughs> that's, my, that's my new tool to get in places. Uh, I've given up on the axe. Crossbow is the way to go. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, so, um, when they get into Alexandria, they uh, basically assign people jobs and uh, there's a, a politician guy who uh, asks Rick if he'll uh, he'll be the sheriff because they don't have one. Whoops. Fell right off of that. Thank you. A hunting knife. Oh, I already know the hunting knife recipe. All right, out of here then. Um, and but there's like a factory or something nearby, and there's a group that uh, um, a group that lives there, and they uh, they're like I don't know robbers. <laughs> They're robber barons, and they, you know, so they, uh, they ride to all the little communities in the area, because there's several of them, apparently, in the common areas, uh, and so they force, under threat of death, the, uh, little communities to give up supplies, uh, oh, you know, and so they have to pay tribute, basically to these, uh, thugs. And, uh, so, uh, of course when they put Rick in charge as sheriff, um, things don't stay that way. And I want to say, like, they're slowly expanding out the community, and so, like, uh, <laughs> The big thing is is that none of the people who are in the village, pretty much, other than the scouts who go out and find people, have ever been outside the walls during the apocalypse. And so they have no idea what's going on. And so when Rick's crew shows up, uh, you know, uh, and gets put in with these people, 
they've been out in it ever since it started and I mean basically I guess the prison was their only break from having to live in the zombie apocalypse and even that wasn't a very good break whereas the people in Alexandria they've never seen a zombie in the town because they sealed it off beforehand and so the work crews go out and the work crews are made up of like new people and uh, they clear out the stuff and collect steel to build on the walls and stuff and um, <laughs> but uh, like they don't even have they don't even have uh, people on watch in the comics when Rick and his group were there and so um, Andrea is like a super sniper at this point in the comic and she uh, she actually goes out and uh, stays in a bell tower in the town nearby because it gives her a view of the area because uh, they don't even have watchtowers in this Alexandria and uh, so she stays out there um, for most of the, the comic once they get there um, she does come back to town for a few things but uh, mostly she's their lookout because um, she of course is on the wrong side of things when the scavenger dudes uh, attack the town because they don't won't give uh, tribute anymore. Yeah. And then I want to think that I want to say that uh, Rick goes after the guy and. Maybe the guy's base is surrounded by zombies. Or Rick opens the door and lets the zombies into the base. I can't remember. That's that's where I quit, was uh, after Alexandria. Um, not so much quit, just uh, didn't think the show was going to get there. And I wasn't really interested in reading it month by month. Um, cause it's a, it's a once a month comic, I think. Maybe it's a once a week comic. Um, I think it's a once a month comic, though. And so when season four started, they were actually really close to, uh, to where the comic was at. And then they had, uh, Terminus wasn't in the comic, and, um... The hospital wasn't in the comic. And so that all that was new to me. But Alexandria, that's definitely definitely new. <laughs> yeah. I hear you growling. You can't get to me though. I'm safe. Yeah, I'm still a few episodes behind on Helix or not Helix. Well Helix, yeah, I haven't watched Helix in a while. Uh ooh, there's my shotgun receiver. I got rid of my shotgun barrel. And the shotgun barrel. What's the pieces I need to... Oh, do I still have my large ration from the beginning of the game? That can't be right. Um, alright. I'm gonna get rid of these. I'm gonna take this. And I'm gonna take this. And I'm gonna dump... Oh, look. These right here. Actually, I'm going to keep these for a minute here and fix my axe. Um, but they, uh, I don't want to leave that. Where are you going? I guess we can do this. Shotgun barrel. Look, I'll beat you with a shotgun barrel. Whoa, man, do you see the amazing graphics on this shotgun barrel? Isn't that just the most amazing? It's so lifelike. I mean, you know, every time you go to load your shotgun barrel and it looks like a burnt-up piece of couch. <laughs> yeah. Okay. X... Alright. 
We've been in there. Have we been in here? We've been in here, right? Yep. We're doing this back end here. So I haven't been in here yet. I think that zombie's gonna come around and try to attack us. Uh, but yeah, really, really good episodes now that we've started back. Um, did that one. I'm not sure if I did this one. Hadn't. Uh huh. That's the recipe I needed to even be able to build the shotgun. Nice. Now I can make a shotgun. I didn't take any shells with me, but I can build a shotgun now. Uh, in fact, why don't we do that? Shotgun. I need. Um. Oh, I heard you coming. He was moving fast. You were a fast zombie. Now you're a dead zombie. Uh, what is that under? I don't remember. Shot. I don't want a mold. I want a shotgun... Pump. Where's my wood? And then I need a shotgun stock. Shotgun. Shotgun. I don't want the short one. Shot gun pump shotgun stock. There we go. Oh yeah, I guess gotta put the wood in there for that to work. Ha ha ha. Okay. Uh, Oh, and the receiver. Derp -de -der. There we go. Nice. And then I'll have a shotgun, and I'll clean up some room in my inventory. All at the same time. Hmm. Uh. Yeah, it should be a, should be a good second half of a season here. Um. I still can't believe they killed uh, Bath. I was really shocked by that. Come in, come in. What you got in the cooler? Water. What you got in the bookcase? Forge and. Urban combat shotgun. Been there. I already learned that. I don't need any more feathers. I don't need any more feathers. Oh man, I think we got one more little thing to loot here. And then we are done with this little town. Or village, or... Oh no, I've already been in here, this says. Yep, I did buckshot and forge. I've been here. Or there just wasn't a door. That said it wouldn't have been touched yet. Alright, well, I guess... Let's check our map. We don't have a road going the direction that I want to go. Do we take the road to the south then, or do we travel cross country? I'm thinking we travel cross country. That might be fun. I'm gonna run down here. And take a quick gander. Let's get you out of the crafting window there. 
I might as well just craft this into a pistol, right? I don't use them enough to carry all this crap, so... Okay. Do I not have the recipe to make a pistol? Am I confused by that? Pistol. There you go. Was that so hard? I'm going to climb this hill here just so we can see what we're getting into. And then we'll call it a day. Uh... Yeah, I'll have to check out some 12 monkeys. Hmm. Alright, I'm gonna go over on this hilltop here. Night night, lady. Your brains are splashed. Oh, look at all these rocks. I should probably head the direction I want to go instead of a different direction here. <laughs> it's just more forest. There's nothing out here. Um. Oh, she's exhausted. Uh, did you think I was coming for you, dear? Oh, we're about to hit another biome, though. Hush up. What kind of biome is this? Oh, it's burnt. Yeah, look at that. It's all ashy now. Alright, well, I think this is a good spot. So, uh... Click like if you like. Subscribe, be sure to catch the next one. And I will talk to you... What's that noise? I'll talk to you later.